Welcome back, UMG Dallas 40K. Of course, Optic Gaming going against Denial here in the Losers Bracket Finals. Optic Gaming up two to one, but finally signs of life coming out of Denial. Able to take that bio or no comeback. Oh, I'm used to hearing Maven call it like BioLink, <laughs> whatever it is. Either way, though, Denial finally he's able to he's get a map on board. He's when he's not even here. Oh, it's so bad. Maven's well, just a character. He most certainly is. However, hard point once again, and the performance from Optic Gaming last time round was phenomenal. 250 to 111. Can I do it again, Chance? Uh, well, yeah, Optic Gaming can without a doubt. The question is whether or not <laughs> Denial can stop them. Obviously, uh, Epsilon did a phenomenal job. Even in the last hardpoint uh, series, the two hardpoint maps were pretty close. So Epsilon uh, might have it figured out against Optic Gaming. If Denial can kind of take notes from them, obviously, they weren't going to be able to do that just now. But potentially, if they could play sort of stylistically similar. And again, these are you know three players, Temp, Huke, and uh, Slasher, that are just phenomenal in terms of slaying abilities. So if they can just step up and have like their A game brought, potentially, they could be able to damage OG. Well... It's a long shot. I feel like it is a long shot. Being honest, I didn't think they'd take the uplink. They played really well. They were fantastic at it. But hard point. Optic Gaming, they're really, really good at it. They've, I mean, Epsilon obviously gave them a bit of a rocking. But considering how well they play first time rounds, this has got to be a 3-1, surely. To call, it, to call it anything else is, is more hoping than anything. I mean... <laughs> Depending on who you're pulling for, hope might be exactly what you need. Uh, of course, we are going to be able to find out what happens just now. Uh, you know, I'm curious. Who are the men of the match for you right now? One person from each team. Who are you going to be looking out for? Uh, in this, so far, it's formal. Um, he's made so many clutch plays. Other than that, I've actually really liked the way Replays is playing. I mean, he's had some really clutch flanks. Uh, and he just, he just seems to be in the right position to kind of throw Optic off a little bit. You can't always come at Optic front on, and he's been doing that. And as you'd expect, he is going to be the hill. Was able to pick up two before it finally gets taken down, but then Huke is going to be right behind him. Uh, again, this is how the hard point started the first time. Denial getting off to a pretty nice start on the first hill. Uh, and then from there, it was just nothing but off the game. But there, Slasher being able to pick up two in the kill feed as well. There's actually oh going to be three goodness. that he picks up. Huke decides to shoot temp, but it doesn't matter. He gets formal as well. That is going to be four down in favor of Denial. Denial milking every single second off his hard point so far. Waiting, Slasher just staying alive in blue, trying to cause a little bit of trouble for the guys of Optic Gamer. Hook still still alive as well. He's on a four streak here. He's trying to get a slam down. He is going to go down himself though. But 35 points on that first hill. And you can see Slasher already sitting in the corner of the next hill. That's not even like a perfect rotation. That's just he spawned there at the very end. Like it's a perfect death for him. But either way, again, Denial going to have your advantage. Slasher is still going to be in the hill, pushing out a little bit just to pick up that kill, uh, stopping Scumpy from breaking in. Crim6 uh, showing life. You see all those Optic Gaming members spawning over there by the green plat, but all the blue arrows are focused right on them. However, Formal and Crim6 picking up kills in the kill feed. Huke uh, trying to slow them down a little bit. Replay is actually stepping out of the hill just for a moment, potentially going to be able to take this hill. Try to shoot at a teammate for a second, but that's going to be another four down in favor of Denial. Flash is just sitting now. Trying to just deflect any pressure from Optic Gaming, and they're doing it fantastically well. Who though? Going to pick up one. Looks for the second. Gets him as well. Shuts him down, but Scump will be there to trade it away. Carmen picking up, and finally, Optic Gaming will be able to take down Escalators, and they will be able to get some points on the board and bring this deficit back under control. Yep, without a doubt. And you can already see with 15 seconds left, that rotation is coming in. You have three Denial members already in or surrounding that Blue Hill, and you can see the players from Optic Gaming were trying to work their way over how all of them got picked up off of that, but still, they were able to get quite a bit of scrap time off that hill to reduce the deficit just to 18 points, but again, Denial has control of Blue, and this is a hill that you can just blow out the lead. Slasher getting those intro kills. Karma oh, trying to work wow. his way in, but Denial just a little bit too strong. Board hook, and he is 10 and 4 at the moment. He's going to go down. On board with replays, he will be holding it down for his squad. Up the game, desperate to break in here. Can they do it this time around? He's not even going to turn. Scumman formal. Now he's going to have to try and engage in the hill. Sees one, picks him up. Can oh he get Scum as well? Who stays alive? Oh Has God. to reload, but goes down before he can do anything. Of the gaming, finally getting in blue. That was a nasty kill by replays, but again, Crim6 was able to get a two-piece to break in, and now it's going to be him and Scumpany in the hill. Huke's going to be trying to break in. Replays is picking up a kill as well. Scump's going to shut him down. Huke trying to get in, but Crim6 is going to be able to pick up two. Scump shunts down that player. Now it's going to be one player, looks like, trying to push in by himself. Uh, Temp is just going to get massacred right there. Ten seconds left, and you see the spawns right now are actually kind of favoring out the gaming. Uh, Denial over there in that purple area, and you see OG spawning by Green Platt already. So OG. Past oh, two hills have been able to work their way in, reduce the deficit by eight, but again, it's going to be a fight for green now. Who's going up, first of all, trying to get control away from Optic Gaming. They don't want to give them an inch in this half point. Already doing so much better than the last half point they played. 
without a doubt. Also, Huke, 14 and 8. Replay is also 14 and 8. Don't expect those big numbers out of Replay. So when oh he puts them up, that God. means some serious work. And Huke just destroying him. Replays is going to take him down. That's going to be a costly mistake. Slasher still in the hill right now. Crimson is going to pick up two. And you see all those Optic Gaming members going to flood. Slasher not going to be able to get the two. Scumpy going to be in the hill for OG. Formal trying to hold down green. Can he try and do anything here? No. Instantly taken down. Karma's going to be the one on the hill. He needs help from his teammates or the pressure will be too much. With denial, flooding and taking, manages to get him anyway. Stays alive. He's going to go back onto the hill to get those points. It's almost time for the rotation here, Chance. Replays was able to pick up two, but of course, Crim6 was there to reply with the two piece of his own. Just eight seconds left, as you said. Huke's still pushing it. Crim6 is going to get that easy kill. Uh, denial not going to be able to push that scrap time. Denial still going to have the lead again in the next hill, but it's only seven points. Uh, again, this middle hard point, always so crazy. You know, when these games come down to the wire, players just jumping around like madmen. There's always at least three bodies in this hill at all time. Now it's going to be Huke, Slasher, Temp, and Scump on the hill. Gunfights going down left and right. It's an absolute bloodbath. Yeah, it's so difficult to clean this hill as well. Like Slasher just being a nuisance, diving in and out they finally get it clean up the gaming they've done this before and got a lot of points on this middle hill scum holding it on snow there's gonna be one coming ice tunnel jump straight above scum scum sees him can't get him though will oh be taken God. down three now of denial flooding this hill trying to take down optic gaming that's just a perfect reply. OG was able to get four down, push them out, and then Denial able to break the middle hill very quickly. Four perfect kills in a okay. row. And now they're getting the control once again. But now you can see OG is going to flood. Potentially, just going to be a 4-4 four, four sweep. Replay is going to be the last one in. OG able to break the middle hard point. Middle hard point just getting traded back and forth. And it does appear Denial is going to stop pushing it. They have one more player in purple, but the rest are already setting up for the middle hill. So we're going to have Optic Gaming in the first lead they've had all game after the first set of rotations, 107 to 104. Scum now, looking to try and do some work. Has managed to get into blue. Going to see a second kill there as well from Scum. Can he get a third? No. Will drop for both these teams. We do head into the second rotation. Chance are so close, it's basically tied. Without a doubt, Crim6 is going to be a player in the hill. Replace is trying to get over there, but you see Karma, Formal, and Crim once again. We're all in the hill. Uh, Formal picking up another attempt, trying to break in. Huke now playing so aggressive right now with the sub. Able to pick up two to work his way in. Huke having another fantastic game. He's always able to put up numbers, sitting at 23 and 17. Is going to get taken down, though. Still, Opti Gaming able to stay in this hill. Slasher trying to do something right now. Able to pick up one, but it looks like he's actually going to get quite a few shots. Potentially almost killed himself. Formal actually killed Skump right there. So team kills coming in. That's going to favor Denial. Denial trying to get back in. Too many people in the hill, though. A lot of contest time here. Yeah, there is. And you know what? Most middle half points have that. I mean, the game, the fact that they've taken even a small lead here shows that they are starting to come back into this game. To be honest with you, most of it, Denial have looked really, really good. And it is going to be a bit of a flip from last time around. This time, OG going to be the first one over to that Eskius Hill. Formal was only able to pick up one there. Slasher going to shut him down. Slasher uh, also who was pulling out the A's someone. Now that's going to be three down in favor of Denial. Denial able to break that hill within 10 seconds. Uh, you know, Opti Gaming had pretty much the perfect setup for it, but just not, did not convert any of the kills. However, able to storm right back in and retake it with another eight seconds. Advanced Warfare, things just happened so ridiculously quick. Now Denial spawning over green, trying to get back into the hill once again. I'm just staying alive for his squad. And then Crimson and Formal will actually just hold this down as well. That is going to be Optic Gaming right there. There's one player left for Denial trying to push him, but Scump is going to take him down in short order. OG starting to extend their lead just a little bit here. Denial, again, one player pushing singularly by himself. He's going to get taken down as well. So Optic Gaming, once again, going to be able to get that scrap time from Messi because this is the biggest lead they've had in this game by far. They're going to be going into blue with about a 40-second lead. And now as we approach blue, I want to find out just how hyped both teams are getting. But let's jump in board first of all with Optic Gaming. Right side. Yeah, one small, one door as well. I hit one hit, 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 yeah, hit one Watch out, watch outside though, watch out. Oh, two in there, two in there. You jump up, you can shoot him. Back to blue, back to blue, back to blue. Watch out, back to blue, back to blue. Slash nice, good one. Wait for us, wait for us, wait for us. I am, I am. Wait. I am, hang on. I'm in the window, they're gonna be dead. Really weak top box. I killed Slasher again. Top box is really weak. There's only two in only two in hill. Push that door, I got the Nice, baby. Let's go. I'm watching purple. Blue cut, blue cut, blue cut, blue cut. Nice. I got him. Pretty good. Wait, Purple, guys, purple, guys. I'm being needed, I'm being needed. Right, I'm I'm back purple, back purple. I'll blink it, two top purple. Watch my side door. I got window. Side door, side door. I'm one shot, Ian, I'm one shot. I'm just gonna door. I gotta still come by the purple. Back door, watch back door. I have it, I have it, I have it. Back door, back door, slash back door. Two, there's two back doors, two of the back doors. I need it. I got it. Oh my god, let's go, boys. Keep holding this, keep holding the bombs. Green, green, he's spawned in front of me, he's bottom shack, and one's two top shack. One's cut, cut. They're hitting it. I got one. I got one. Look at the window. I got a fucking bow. Top long. We got turbine, turbine, turbine. He might go cut. He got me. Yo, weak, weak, weak back. Okay, I'm okay. Not really. He's not that weak. Oh, he's up. Oh, he went all the way back. All good, all good. Okay, what's up? Alright, we're fine, guys. Yeah, we're fine. Everybody, push through green together. Got him. I spawned here with you. I spawned. One's back, back up, please. I'm gonna get him. 
Oh shit, you need to be Two, two, bottom green up, two bottom green up. Oh, I nice. put him in my He's one shot, one shot, bottom green up. Watch your green, watch your green. Spawn behind one. Push me, push me. Just spawned out. Watch out, Hill. Okay, there you go. You can hear the communication of the gaming clear and concise as always from this team. Yeah, without a doubt. Now, we're to the point where there's only a minute and 20 seconds left in this game. Denial able to reduce the deficit again uh, to about 30 points. However, Opti Gaming coming in full force to get on Green Plat, uh, trying to clear him out. They're actually going to have control of this hill, trying to extend their lead as much as possible. Uh, game potentially going to come down to the wire. However, OG looking to start to blow it out towards the end again. About a 40 point difference between these two teams. Just a minute left. It's going to come all the way down to this middle hard point. But of course, we've seen it before. Uh, you know, Denial was able to break through and were able to hold it down for a decent amount of time. But that's exactly going to have to do it again. Again, 50 seconds left in this match. The Nile does have control. They're going to have to hold it down for nearly the entire time. This is an almost impossible hold, and I think trying to work this out mathematically, I think they're done. I think oh, Optic no. Gaming have won this already without even having to worry about this last hill. Oh, well, then if that's the case, then Optic Gaming going to be moving on to your grand finals. Let's hear it for OG. The green wall coming up clutch once again, doing Partner it the three. hard way round. But my goodness, like I said, when you drop into that loser bracket, it becomes a slog. It becomes a marathon. You have to play so many games knowing that your neck is on the line in every single one. They've been scared. They've been shook, but they're still standing. And they will go on to face phase in the grand final here at UMG. And could you ask for anything more? People were predicting phase to be among your top three teams in the game. And this is a new roster potentially able to take down OG. We're going to be able to find out. And again, Optic Gaming, since they're coming out of loser's bracket, they're going to have to win two best of five series to be able to pull it off. Phase just having to shut it down in one. Well, there you go. I mean. It was it was impressive there. I did think this denial squad they had a good few chances. They had the opportunity to do this several times. That was not the same hard point as we saw in the first game. They clutched up up big, but denial certainly got the legs. Without a doubt. And it was a pretty huge blue hill as well. Yeah. Uh, you saw Optic Gaming going into it. Had about a 40-second lead. Uh, and it looked like Denial was going to be able to lock it down. They had it for about 25 seconds, but then OG broke. But potentially, uh, Denial being able to hold that one down. Again, it came down to 38 seconds. If they got the remaining 30, it uh, would have been a completely different map. You know you know what? It's uh, It's been really impressive from these guys all day. Like I said, this is the hardest way to get into that final. But... There is your man of the match for Control Freaks. You remember, hashtag KFMVP to vote. Join the match for a chance to win some is Crimzix this time around. So make sure you vote for the grand final. From me and Chance, that is it. We will not be casting the rest of this. It's going to be Courage and Benton bringing you the grand final very, very shortly. So see you soon.